In his 4th of July message, President Biden had this to say about the Highland Park shooting. You all heard what happened. You all heard what happened today. But each day, we're reminded there's nothing guaranteed about our democracy, nothing guaranteed about our way of life. We have to fight for it, defend it, and earn it by voting. Let's get more from the White House now. Our Rachel Scott is there. Rachel, good morning to you. TJ, good morning. We know that the president is closely monitoring the situation in Highland Park. He did speak by phone to both the mayor and the governor, offering the full resources of the federal government. The president also released a statement saying that he is shocked by the senseless gun violence, noting that he recently signed the first major bipartisan gun reform legislation in almost 30 years into law, but there is still much more work to do. And here is the stark reality. Since the president signed that bill in to law just over a week ago, there have been at least two dozen mass shootings in this country. The president did not get everything he wanted in that bill. No assault weapons ban. It did not raise the legal age limit to purchase those type of firearms. That was a non-starter for most Republicans. But this morning, we are hearing from a growing number of Democrats who say it's time to come back to the negotiating table and do much more on gun violence, TJ. We shall see. Rachel, thank you as always. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.